Hello and welcome. In this session, we are going to learn what is uh, the usage of Python in PostgreSQL or how do we integrate uh, Python for the PostgreSQL. So you already might be aware that uh, Python is one of the most uh, powerful uh, programming language nowadays and uh, this has been everywhere. So we will try to see for PostgreSQL database how can we use it to a minimum extent. So we will see the module which is being used for Postgre and we will see a basic task basic thing in PostgreSQL like how do we come make a connection to the database and uh, then how do we create a table how do we insert uh, one or two row and then how do we display the data from the table so this is all about uh, what we are going to see in this demo so the first thing the PostgreSQL database can be integrated with Python using this module which is PSY copg2 module so what i'm going to do is i already have an internet connectivity with my postgre server so i'll just say sudo yum install python and uh, the module since it is already installed uh, so it will show uh, it's already installed and with the latest version so nothing to do so, uh, but in your system it is a Linux environment you have to install this module for for your uh, database so the next thing which we are going to do is we are directly going to create a Python script and we are going to log into the database so I'll show you the script which is there so the script name is login postgre.py so we are just saying the location of the python uh, executable and uh, then we are importing the module which we have just installed so this is very important then we are going to say uh, connection equal to the module name and then we are connecting and then we are saying database which database i want to connect i want to connect with the uh, dvd rental user is postgre password is password this is the host ip and this is the port number where postgre is running and then it is going to display the database login successful we are not going to mention if uh, any of the parameter is wrong how to handle that we are not doing that it's just a straightforward basic very basic postgre uh, python script so we'll just say python and the script will try to execute and we'll see if it displays the success or not so it is uh, displaying database login successful since it has met all this criteria so it has printed the login successful now what we are going to do in the second step we are going to create a table to create the table this is the script which we are going to use so we just mentioned the python and then we are going to import the module so we are just saying import and the module names then in the connection we are just saying the module dot connect and the connection string this is the detail of the connection string database name username password host ip and the port name then it is going to print whether login is successful or not once it is successful then um, uh, we are uh, mentioning the cursor and then if we are going to execute the create table statement for a table called as films and that has one column with the code and it is going to store uh, care 5 and then it will display the table creation completed successfully so let me first uh, connect to postgre and drop that table it is not there I believe so let us go and execute create a table and then we will say Python and the create table 
so table creation is successful now what we will do next is we will insert a row for inserting a row we have uh, the script so it is just insert data dot uh, py what we are doing over here is the same thing we are going to import the module then in the connect we are just saying uh, we are giving the uh, dot connect and then we are showing uh, we are mentioning all the details which are required for the connection so once it is connected then we are going to execute the so the, you need to understand what is this uh, uh, the connect module and then you have the cur in the cursor you have execute okay so in the execute we are just saying insert into films and then the column name and here is the data then we are going to commit it and then it is going to print the message and then it is going finally going to close the connection so let's execute it python and uh, insert data uh, py th1 okay the records are inserted and the final one where uh, since there is no index created uh, and there is no constraint so if I insert the same record n number of times it is going to be getting inserted over here the first last one in this one is the selecting the data so we are just going to select the data what we are doing again is we are going to import the module then we are going to connect it this is the connect string and and uh, i believe i have created some more table so here okay this is this is going to display so once i have mentioned the uh, connection details it is going to since i my table films has one column only so i'll just say when you are displaying the rows just display all the rows okay so this is going to display since it has only one row so it is going to display only one uh, column details so let's execute it python and select data dot py so you can see this is the data which is available as of now there are many rows so with the same uh, output because uh, uh, I have inserted this many times uh, during the creation of this demo so this is just the basic there are a lot of things which can be done depending upon what do you want so it is just like uh, just just what we have done is we tried how to connect to the database then we had created a table then we we created uh, uh, we inserted some row and then finally we fetched the data if you know the basics of this this will be useful and uh, uh, you can implement many more things as you move further i hope this the basic thing is going to help you and uh, thanks for watching